Hey guys, what's going on? Forlorn here. Got a TDM on Raid today, Black Ops 2 on the Wii U. And I wanted to talk a bit about the new reveal for, well not new, it's a couple days old now, for the Nintendo Switch. But, it finally happened. We finally know what's actually, like, what the system is. And, well, the rumors were generally true. Like, the idea, it was basically all leaked, the actual concept itself, but we didn't have, like, the exact... We didn't know exactly what it was, or, like, pictures and all that, and it's, it's really cool to see. And I actually really, really like the concept, because the thing is, like, handheld gaming as a whole has just been slowly dying out because of mobile. Like, not handheld gaming itself, but just, like, the, what I mean is, like, the actual separate things, like, the, the handheld consoles, like, the 3DS and the Vita and all that. So I think that Nintendo, realizing this, decided to kind of combine the two with the, kind of the declining handheld console market and the failure of the Wii U, right? Because... As much as I like my Wii U, it was a bit of a disaster. But I really like the concept. Looks fun. I like the way the controllers look, and they showed a actual like regular Pro controller as a controller -er 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 as well, which is nice to see. That's what I was really looking for because honestly, like the controllers are cool and the gimmick is nice and I like it. But I do still need a regular controller if I'm gonna be playing on a console. So that was good to see. Also nice to see. The, they showed Skyrim in like NBA, which hints at some good third-party support at least at launch. Hopefully we get some uh, FPS action in there, maybe like Modern Warfare Remastered I'd like to see. I already have that pre-ordered, but <laughs> we'll have to see what happens there. I'd love to see one good shooter out at least. We saw Splatoon, saw a new Mario Kart, Mario game, of course Legend of Zelda, which looks amazing. Some good stuff for the reveal. We're gonna have to wait and see how the rest of the launch titles shape up because honestly like launch titles are going to be a very big thing for that console I think especially with like the abysmal third party support from the Wii U people are going to want to see some real good third party launch titles to have some faith we also had the like <laughs> honestly it, it, it was pretty it was pretty unrealistic I think you know people are just going to be hanging around on rooftops playing their Nintendo Switch <laughs> just just gonna get that out of the way because uh, I think I think most people will agree that that is unrealistic. Um, the thing I'm wondering about is how often will people actually use that aspect? Like, I, I don't know. The handhelds to me, like, do, am I really gonna carry that around versus just having some random stuff on my phone like Fallout Shelter or like whatever random games I can find, like Final Fantasy. There's some mobile games. There's a ton of random mobile games. Will it actually like be able to compete with that? I honestly don't know. Uh, the other thing is that. As ex like to be expected, really, but the frame rate when they showed the uh, like mobile console per uh, portion, the frame rate was really low. Like it looked like it was dropping down to like 15 frames a second there. But that's expected. I just assuming it's still like maybe maybe it's just gonna be optimized. I don't know. We're gonna have to see how that plays out because like I'm gonna be honest, that Legend of the what's it called? That Legend of Zelda part where like they were on the mobile thing and he was shooting the arrow at the like mob or whatever. That looked honestly like that frame rate's unplayable. <laughs> I'm not playing on like t 20 frames per second. I'm sorry. So hopefully that uh, does not turn out to be an issue. That was the one real downside I noticed. But apart from that, everything looked great. Price points, not sure yet. I've heard rumors of like 400 bucks, which is fine by me, since you're basically like gonna you buy it and you save money on buying like a 3DS and all that anyway. So as for other games we still need to, I would still like to see of course Pokemon like I said a shooter obviously well with NBA I'm assuming the other sports games will come out on it like FIFA and all that uh, what else would there be I guess Fallout but if they're making Skyrim maybe they'll make Fallout 4 for it as well hard to see hard to see you're gonna have to see how the wait and see how everything shapes up for the launch titles like I said but honestly very solid I'd, I'd rate that reveal a, a solid 7 above average better than expected you know five is five is average remember five is average this is not the ign rating scale so seven is above average don't rip me apart for this so yeah i'm happy with it hope you guys enjoyed it too i'll see everyone later